myself and see how much I weigh. As we're doing the eight mile challenge, it's eight miles a day. You either can run, walk, crawl, whatever. The challenge is just to get eight miles a day. Uh, that's about 18,000 steps, roughly. So let's weigh. This is the, I think it's Renfo. I think that's how they pronounce it, Renfo. Uh, you can find it on Amazon. It's really cheap. It's really an awesome scale. It Bluetooths to your phone. Uh, I'm using a Galaxy Note 8. Um, it's early. I don't want to wake all the kids up. I don't want to wake up uh, my wife to do this eight mile challenge. So let's, first what you want to do is you want to step on it just a little bit and then step back off and it calibrates itself. Now step on. We were outside, we made it out without waking anybody up. We're going to start off walking for a mile challenge this morning. I'm using a phone gimbal this morning. Uh, just to keep things steady. It's the Moza Mini S phone gimbal. Okay, we're done. So 1.1 miles, and that's about 2,200 steps roughly for this morning. We'll see you later tonight. And uh, I'll tell you later on in the video why I started this challenge. It is the eight mile challenge, eight miles a day. Crawl it, run it, walk it, just get eight miles, or roughly 18,000 steps. I'll see you later tonight. Hey, what's up everyone? It's Guy for Ludi TV. It's uh, coming up on 6 o'clock. We put in 6.63 miles, 17,064 steps. So we're going to go out to my favorite trail and we're going to walk slash run the rest of it. And I'll take the phone gimbal out. That way it's kind of a smooth video. We're using that uh, Moza Mini S. So, alright, we'll see you at the trail. Here we are. My favorite running trail, we're going to, I got about six and a half miles in just throughout the day, um, walking around, running, and we're going to finish up with uh, just a mile and a half, two miles just to be safe that we make it. So let's go.
All right. So we did two pavements. We did two. Oh gosh, two pavements and two trails. So if you do a pavement and a trail run, it's exactly a mile. And we did that twice. So we got two miles in. We were about six and a half miles. So we we got to reach our mark. We're at our mark. I know we're at our mark. I just don't want to uh, show you going this way because film should be shot this way. If I did it the other way, Martin Scorsese wouldn't hear the end of it. Or not. Well, we'll check out the statistics when I when I get back home. But uh, I think we made our eight miles. Hey, we're back at home. It's Gabe for Ludi TV and uh, Gabe's vlog. As you can see, we just made it 8.08 miles with 20,386 steps. So we made the eight mile mark. And uh, I want to tell you why I started it. So hang on. All right. So I started the eight mile challenge because um, of a coworker. She was always hitting eight miles, you know, consistently every single day. And I was doing like six, something like that. And not only that, I didn't want to do portion control. I didn't want to do, you know, beach body. I, I didn't want to do any of those things. I thought that maybe, you know, if she was hitting eight miles a day, I could hit eight miles a day. So thus, spawn this eight mile challenge and I've done I've done 40 miles in the last five days and it's been so tiring my hip flexors are just they're, they're killing me um, I get to deal with mosquitoes the heat because I got to reach that goal I got to still spend time with family so I got to get it quickly uh, I work in a big hospital but and I put in a lot of steps but I still have that extra three, four miles to hit, you know, after work, and I try to get that done right away. So um, that's how the eight mile challenge started. It's working for me. So if diets aren't working for you, yeah, I'm, I'm eating low carb things. I'm, I'm keeping away from breads, pastas, things like that. You know, keto, paleo, uh, Atkins, whatever you want to call it. Um, a little bit of that is, is thrown in there. Um, along with the eight mile challenge every day so follow along I'll try to I'll try to keep it up every single day I don't know how how much I'm gonna carry around that uh, that Moza Mini S that phone stabilizer it's 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 nice but I felt like when I was running I was holding like the Olympic torch the whole time I kept switching hands so I, I definitely got an upper body workout you know just holding that thing and of course eight miles of lower body, so um, we'll probably do more. Thanks for watching.